Yeah, coach, uh, you know, first of all, yeah, I give, uh, I think, Malcolm on the ball, just the ball pressure. You know, it's always pivotal. And, you know, those play, kind of plays breaking down. And, uh, coach got him in the first half or in a similar play where I was just kind of standing. He was able to push off push off and get open. But, you know, it was kind of into his body this time. And, you know, the main main play, pass was a little bit behind him, and I, I was able to be there. And still I'm just curious, though, like, through the three quarters, you guys were shooting seventy percent and only up, you know, ten points or so. <laughs> was there a level of concern there that you were not putting them away, or uh, you know, it's the NBA, and you know, you gotta give them credit. A very dangerous team, you know, with some uh, you know, some quirky things out there, you know, two three zone, uh, super small lineups. Uh, so uh, they throw a lot at you, and you know, uh, with a big emotional win uh, Monday up in Boston, you know, it was a kind of a trap game, but you know, we. We've been in this position before where we've had a huge win and, and came in and, and slipped up, but uh, we stayed the course. You know, it wasn't pretty, but you know, you'll take it. So many big plays, you know, Tim's three pointer, Paul shot, your steal. Just kind of wondering, what was that like to lap when they're up down by, when you're down by four? Mm -hmm. uh, gotta keep the way you came back. Yeah, you gotta keep playing. Uh, a lot of time left, and uh, with, how, with how we had been playing earlier in the game, you know, we knew uh, we were only a shot to away. And, you know, like I said, you gotta give him credit though. Uh, you know, Seth Curry was huge for him. Down the stretch, Harrison Barnes, and, you know, Dirk Whiskey is always gonna make shots here and there. So, uh, you know, yeah, they threw a lot at us, and uh, you know, who's win for us? You know, to start the start this home stand like on the right foot. The 23 turnovers you got is that kind of what allowed them to get back in it too? Yeah, uh, I think uh, you know, anytime you turn the ball over you know, 15 plus times, you're gonna be in a dog fight. So, uh, 23 is a huge number. Obviously, we know we got to do a better job of protecting the ball, but a lot of it is, you know, uh, having the right mindset, you know, trying to make the right plays. But, uh, you know, you only see a 2-3 two, three, two, three zone, you know, once or twice a year. So <laughs> it's kind of an adjustment on the rim. When did they go to that just in the first in the first half there after Dwight was? Yeah, he, they spotted it uh, a little bit early, and then late they just stayed in and, and okay. uh, switched everything. And, uh, you know, we still try to run our stuff, and, you know, it's, that's what we got to do. We got to do a better job of executing. You know, regardless of what defense the other team's in. So, uh, it's a lot of growing pains, and, you know, we, we turn a new leaf uh, Monday and try to keep this thing rolling. I don't want to make too much of it, but just the way the offense has played the last two games, is that what gives you confidence, or you feel like it's in the right direction there? How do you look at it? Well, uh, a couple of weeks ago, I had a long talk with Coach, and uh, he brought up a good point. You know, I think we're playing, you know, very good defense if you're the offense, we're able to get out and run. Uh, we're able to use athleticism, you know, Dwight on the rim, Dennis in transition, uh, myself, Tim, Tabo, you know, a lot of guys can get out running. Uh, when we're doing that, the ball is moving, you know, teams are scrambling, trying to cover us, and, uh, you know, it's a good synergy out there when we get stopped to run. Can you take me through that long conversation a little bit? Just was, what was the impetus for it? Oh, uh, no, just, you know, checking, you know, a lot of buzz, and we have uh, a few talks occasionally, you know, you just talk to me, you know. Right. And, Sit down and chat. You know, we've been around each other for a long time, and still got a while to go. So uh, it's good to have that kind of relationship. Yeah, that what was the difference for you guys from three point range? You guys are almost fifty percent tonight. Though was it better looks or uh, just you know guys playing more freely and obviously better looks. You know when you're opening or you got a guy closing out and you know the ball's moving. It's you know, such a good feeling and you know good things happen when you're playing hard. And uh, this past few games we've been doing just that, playing hard, sharing the ball, and guys have been making shots.